thank you to my wife for um, introducing me and welcoming me on her channel. Um, since there aren't that many, there's a, a couple of videos out there on YouTube um, explaining hospital bags for dads, but they all, I feel like they all like missing a thing here and there, so I'm gonna, here's mine. Um, starting off with a blanket, you know how cold hospitals can be. Uh, I got some slippers for myself to keep my feet warm. Uh, my wife got me this nice little um, toiletry bag with all kinds of mini toiletries. Got some underwear. I got some t-shirts and a pajama shirt and you know, getting ready for a big day. And not to mention, I gotta be touching it. So it's gotta have a bicycle. All right, and I have one pair of shorts and one pair of sweatpants, um, depending on um, what temperature is outside. I've got a hoodie, keep me warm. I've got some socks, got warm socks and regular socks. Obviously it had to have beer on it. Um, then I have one extra sock sitting here by itself that has two tennis balls going in it to help me uh, massage my wife's back um, just before labor, to help with back pains. Uh, what else do we have? We have some snacks here for my wife that she might need. Some of her favorite ones. Um, wasabi snacks uh, and more wasabi snacks or seaweed snacks. Here's some prune juice. Um, a lot of hostel bags say you gotta have prune juice for the wife. I forgot what it was for, but it was important. For pooping. Okay, yeah. So to make sure the wife passes her constipation. Then we have the Mama Natural affirmation box so just little cards i got to read out for her during during labor to keep her um, um from screaming at me i guess this little thing is just a little little joke we have um it's just a couple bottles of liquor so whenever she's done with labor she can finally drink again after nine months obviously she has to breastfeed she won't be able to but you know at some point she will all the electronics put in this little section here we've got a camera camera battery charger extra battery pack uh, we get some AirPods, uh, chargers for iPhone, I watch charger. Also got some wired headphones for when your um, Bluetooth ones die. So you wanna make sure you're able to listen to music on your own while you're relaxing. Got a speaker so that we can play some music for the wife during labor. So that she doesn't put headphones in, which will most likely fall out from all the pushing and stuff. Um, speaker charger and then obviously a, um, a, a towel to dry myself up with after I okay, take a shower. So I think that includes my, my bag, yeah. And your flip-flops will go into your bag. And my flip-flops that I'm currently wearing will, will go into that bag as well. Mm -hmm. So I can shower with those, probably just do it bare feet because I'm not a germaphobe. You not? No, hmm. it looks pretty clean in the hospital today. Hmm. So, yeah. I think you're a germaphobe. Don't lie to my, to my people. Okay, well, anyway, the hospital looks clean when we visited today. It was clean. I might not even take them with me. I'll, oh. probably, I'll probably forget about them. Okay. guys thank you so much for watching me um, pack my hospital bag um, I hope you guys can take some information away from it for yourself get some tips and tricks out of it um, if, you, if you see something that I think I forgot um, make a new video add it to it comment in it uh, don't forget to like share it subscribe 
this video uh, and to this channel, my wife's channel. Um, as you may have noticed, her tag is not in this video for Instagram, as it is my video, so I'm gonna put my tag in it. It's gonna be up here somewhere. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, wish us luck. Thank you, bye.